What is up, everybody? Standing ovation here again with another break, and it's time for more extended. I missed this on release day a couple of weeks back. I did manage to get some. Uh, as I say, I don't know how many of you follow me, but I had to go like through hell and high water to get this thing, really. It was, uh, again, all due to a forest fire in my area who, who, what? Like the forest fire has a personality. Sometimes you think they do. But I think the guys, the workers, uh, it was really good. The firemen, they got it under control. However, the highway was damaged. So for the next couple of days, we're, I still can't get it under the highway. So I'm going to miss platinum release day too. I'm going to wait till the highway opens after the weekend and go and get it next week. Um, and in the meantime, I've been ripping a case of ice, which I did pick up, well, a half case of ice. So be check out all my other videos where I'm ripping ice. Uh, I've put a whole bunch of the videos up there. I still have four boxes to go. So we'll see when that uh, those get slipped in there. But yeah, tap the like button, subscribe if you like watching break videos. That's what I do on this channel. Hockey mostly, but I do all the sports. I throw them all up there. I'm really working hard to get to that 1,000 subscribers. Uh, thanks to everybody who subscribed. And if you are subscribing, make sure it's a sub on public settings. Because when I do giveaways, you have to be publicly subscribed subscribe to to win the prizes right now i'm doing a giveaway um uh, well it's this is probably over by the time i've po posted this so i have a feeling my 1000 subscriber giveaway is up and running right now so check the link below down that way um and you'll see a, a you could like link to watch a video and perhaps win some prizes uh okay anyway extended i opened up a box of this last week i, I picked up a couple and only opened the one and then i posted that in advance so it'll be the results from my last giveaway uh at the end of that video will be uh the results to the last giveaway the 16 packs giveaway but that was a while ago when i broke that video and i broke that box i still have two more i have this one again i wasn't terribly excited with the checklist but as time's settling in i'm realizing all the uh, Young Guns Acetates are in this. And then next year, this is going to be the only place you get them. As they used to put those in SP Authentic, which I always kind of wondered why they did that. But I have a feeling SP Authentic is going to have their own acetates start showing up in the packs. And they're leaving the uh, uh, Young Gun, or the Extended Series is where you're going to be known for always finding the Young Guns. Which, if you're new to the hobby, the acetates are the rarest of the all the Young Guns. There's also a clear cut. There's a high gloss. I don't know if what would be more rare, the high gloss or the clear cut, because the high gloss is their number to 10. But then there's the UD exclusives. There's the French variant. Next year, there's going to be one of ones even, but there's a bunch of different Young Guns parallels. And the ones that people really, really like often are the acetate, uh, which is kind of like a three-dimensional acetate opposed to the, to the clear cut. But most of the people watching this know that already, so I'm just talking redundantly. I'm just talking. That's I, I do. I know I talk too much. Less talking, more ripping. I'll get to it. Let's go. Okie dokie. Let's see what we can do with these 24. Hobby boxes are always my favorite to rip. I'm sure the retail boxes are out there right now too, but again, I'm, I'm all stuck in the city in the west coast of Canada, and I, they don't let me out very much. Yeah. I guess I could look online, but I actually, you know what? I don't know if retail, I think retail comes out on Wednesday as well with platinum. So I'll be watching for my platinum breaks uh, eventually next week or the week after, which it might be even this week when I've posted this. So check out, watch for platinum breaks because we'll PG platinum. Um, I don't know how, if I'll get a half case of that or a case or how it comes. I think there's eight boxes in a case and it's probably going to be about 2000 bucks for that. Probably about the same price of ice, but in ice you get four, you get 12 boxes as opposed to eight. Anyway, we'll see what happens. If I can even get a case, it might be all sold out by the time they, I get out of town. Okay, where are we going here? Kirby Doc. Kirby Doc. Starting us off. I, I, oh yeah, this is extended. I've only done this once. So these pictures are all kind of new to me. Okay, Lindgren, Jones, Sandheim. Here's a, oh, nice. Oh, nice. Connor McDavid. Every time you pull a Connor McDavid, that's your inside voice saying, oh, nice. Unless you, like, totally hate him, but why would you? This guy's, like, the best in the world. Uh, these are, like, acetate cards that you can't see through. Okay, smooth grooves. An old idea it was 97, 98 Upper Deck Series 2 was where I first saw smooth grooves. It was, like, a 60-card subset. They were actually kind of cool back then, but didn't look like those. They were not not acetate cards, that's for sure. Kuznetsov, Huberdo, and Yarkrock. On the rock. Shout out to everybody way across the country in Newfoundland watching me on the rock. I'm on the farthest. I'm about the far. Actually, Tofino and Uculet are further west than me. I don't know. Up the island, I think there's a town too. But I'm about as far west as you can go in Canada. I said I was going to drive west. I meant it. 
I drove west and I kept going. Stepan, Cece, Kunin, Young Guns, Simon Holmstrom. Again, a lot of people have tried to say this guy's better than the other guy or whatever, but this checklist of Young Guns is kind of stinks. Let's just face it. The Marshenko from Columbus and the uh, the kid there in Detroit. Uh, I pulled him in my last box and I already forgot his name. That's how good he is. That's how much of an impression he made on me. But there's uh, about five guys that are kind of up at the $10 or more range. The rest are all just like dollar dollar cards. Mikey Anderson. Luke Lindenning. Kirill Kaprizov, All-Star. Brett Kulak. Canvas. Sergachev. A whole All-Star. Wallstrom and Phil the Thrill. Give me another hot dog in the cup kessel. Whoops. Yeah, I saw the pictures. Apparently, he's already done it again. Somebody, uh, I saw a text chain through the Stanley Cup team there. They were, someone I think I was watching online. I can't remember whose podcast it was, but the question came up. Do you know if Kessel put a hot dog in the cup again? And the answer was, yes, he has. Dry's idle. I know he put the baby in the cup. That was kind of cute. Brady to Chuck. Bergeron. Dry's idle. Three star. Diamond. Triple diamond. That's 96, 97. Oh, 607 design again. Black Diamond, Mrazic, Olimata, Carpenter, Nicky Foligno, Foligno. Okay, Zach Paris, Darcy Kemper, Claude Giroux All-Star, Yaroslav Halak, Suzuki, Retro, 97, 98, Upper Deck. I say 90, I'm going back to the 90s all the time. It's like, like, dream on. 0708 tribute. Nick Suzuki, number T37. Goodbrinson, Dakota Joshua, and Claude Giroux as a Senators. Not an All Star, and not a Flyers. All right. We got Mike Matheson, Roman Josie All Star, Cop, Young Guns, Anton Levchi. Florida Panthers. You know, I remember hearing his name in the playoffs. Brett Burns, Sean Monahan, McKayev, and Mason Shaw. Yeah, mostly depth guys. That's the thing. And even in extended series, a lot of this checklist is made up of the players that upper deck didn't deem worthy of being on checklist one and two. So they're like the depth guys. Plus all the late season trades. Or, you know, like the Giroux card as a Senators. There's Protoss. Nicola, Nick Delorier. Hublo, Nikki Alexandrov, Blues Dazzlers, 137, very dazzling, they're always so dazzling, those Dazzlers, blue, pink in the hobbies, green, orange in the retail, purple online, and somewhere you get red, oh yeah, reds are also in the retail hangers, gravity fed, that's what I meant to say, Matty to Chuck, there's a Panthers card of him, just about the thing hanging out. John Marino, Nick Sturm, and Joey Valeno. Joey V. Brendan Smith, Anti Ranta, Rasmus Sandine, Nick Jungstad, French variant, Naz Kadri All Star. Throw me for a sec with all that extra writing in there. Uh, let's just bury the canvas. Andreas Athanasiu. Debrinket and Lukov. I guess I don't have to bury the canvas. Put it up there. Top shelfer. Top shelf where they keep the peanut butter. Who is the commentator that used to say that? He scores. That was Jim. Was that? That was Hebsey on, on uh, Global News in Toronto back in the 80s and 90s on TV on the Hebsey Awards. Top shelf where they keep the peanut butter. Remember uh, Mark Hebsher and Jim Taddy? That was like Sports Line. That was a good uh, sports, sports show Global had on. Way back in the day. Anyway, I'm I'm digressing. What is it? I just can't get back into 2023. Okay, here we go. Uh, Burkowski, Justin Hole, John Gibson, All-Star. Jake Sanderson, Draft. These are like Young Guns, but they're not. They're one in four packs between Young Guns and All-Stars. Or, not All-Stars. First round drafts, you get six in a box. So, the Young Guns checklist, there's only 30. So, they made, I think it's 20 of those to make the 50 Young Guns. Or the short print part of the set. That's your Demko All-Star. 
cool goalie card put that in my goalie card collection well I just if the mask is big enough i'll keep that picture with Uyghur, lawrence and good brinson yeah i don't know why ever since upper decks early days if i see a good goalie card like a goalie mask picture i keep it only if it's a base card though i don't spend big bucks on inserts just a cool card like that that's a keeper you gotta have something to collect right like all these cards worth money i want to keep them but i gotta sell them to keep doing this so if you like what you see here check it out on ebay help support the channel eventually a lot of this stuff gets put up there but right now i got like 300 items and i try to do sunday night auctions 99 cent auctions ending sunday nights so check it out if you're in the buying mode flat grider stature canvas curtis joseph that's the retired legends canvas cujo i met him once in toronto at the uh 401 and 400 Weston Hotel, was it? They did a card show on Wednesday night, eh, way back in the day. He was standing there out in the hallway. It was easy autograph to get. It was free. You didn't even have to pay to get autographed back then. Yeah, cool. Cujo. He made it to the Leafs eventually, but his best days, I think, really were with the Blues and the Leafs. Although he made it to the Oilers and where else he played, I don't know. Curtis Joseph. All around fine person. Same steel. Logan O'Connor, Jeff Petrie, there's a Dylan Holloway, Rookie Chums, again the 06 07 design. Got two Oilers, that's cool. George Ev, Middleton, Benoit, and Brassard. Okay, last half is gone. 12 pack in the box. 12. If you're keeping score at home, number 12. Jordan Cairo, Klingberg, Dylan Larkin. Trangelo, those are all stars. Here's a Jordan Eberle tribute. Okay, where did I put my first tribute? Let's put it there. Nito Niederreiter, Colin Miller, and Patrick Nemeth. Nemeth. My name is Patrick. Okay. March or so, I see something shiny coming up. Shiny things. I like shiny things. Congrats to Marcia Owen and Stanley Cup and his con Smythe. Good on you. Good on you, mate. Ilya Samson off. That's a cool card. I uh, got Stammer, All Star, and Nikita Zadorov. Okay, it's the Maddie to Chuck. What do you call these? History class? That's what it says right there. Good to read it. And these are like one in 60 packs. They're not super rare, but they're kind of rare. But he's popular right now. This card's got to be worth like thousands of dollars. Or not. You got Kravtsov. Krav, Kravtsov. Uh, he's Canuck now, or is he in Russia? I can't remember. Justin Schultz and Justin Braun. I think he's in Russia, and he's done that before. Okie dokie. Let's go. Let's go. What do we got here? Mason Marchment. Philip Grubar. Does anybody else have, like, 6,000 rookie cards of him. Like, young guns are not the easiest to hit. But I don't know why. In 2021, I had, like... I don't know. I must have, like, 11 young guns of Mason Marchman for some reason. Don't know why. If you need one, check me out. I got probably got some for sale on eBay. Okay. Grubauer. Josh Marha. Okay. Here's one of these SPX cards. Um, what do you call it? 97, 98. See, now I am in the 90s. Or am I? Is it 07, 08 with these two? I think it's 97, 98, actually. No, it's 07, 08. I really don't know. It's one of those 7, 8 years. Yeah. Maybe it was 37, 38. Yeah, this is a Parkhurst uh, tribute card. Anyway, there's Braden Schneider. Brendan Schneider? Braden Schneider. Son of Matthew, I believe. I believe but I'm not 100%. I just made it up if it isn't fact. Murray, Calvin DeHaan, Jason Zucker, Gabe Velarde. And I take pride in providing you with the most made-up facts on all YouTube breakers ever. I just, I just go with it. I believe what I believe. I'm like, just trudge forward and who cares about the truth, right? Uh, maybe not. Vasilevsky, Dermot, Timo Meyer, All-Star. Brock McGinn. He's from Fergus, Ontario. Although I pointed that out before. Jamie Ben. Jamie Ben. 
Wait a minute. Is it Jamie McGinn? He's from Fergus. Was Brock born there too? Yeah, of course he is. They're brothers. I'm kind of smart, but not that smart. I am so smart. SMRT. Clayton Keller, uh, Derek Ryan, and good old Scott Wedgwood. There's got to be one more big, big, like, hobby-only hit card in this, right? Hopefully. There's a Freddie Anderson. See, that mask is nice, but it's not full-on, and it's not quite big enough. So that would not make my mask collection. Just saying. Nemestikov. Mark Stahl. Matt Boldy. Another good one. First draft. What was he, the second or third overall pick? Twelfth pick overall. See, I don't know. I'm just making stuff up again. Uh, McDavid All-Star. Nick Suzuki. Gustafsson and Romanoff. Roman on and Roman off. We got Fabian Zetterland, Jenny Sveshnikov, Jack Campbell, Colin Blackwell. Okay, here's a tribute of Matt Boldy. 97, 90, or duh, 07, 08. Let's just say whenever I say 97, 98, drink. No, don't, because everybody pass out by the time the video ended. Uh, where did I put my other tributes? There. Ben Hutton. Christian Jari. And Vincent Trocek. Yeah, now we're uh, middle of the summer again. Who's the trades? What what ha what trades are happening? Who's going to sign where? July 1st, it, it all takes place. And uh, the awards are about to happen next week. David Riddich. Thomas Grease. Samuelson. Marcus Bjork, the wrong Blue Jackets rookie, but you know maybe maybe he's going to be the guy after um, Babcock comes into town and changes everything, and everybody loves him, right? See, that's almost qualifying. I don't know, maybe maybe I could go back on my words because that profile picture is kind of big enough mask. I'm going to keep that one too. Eric Wallop, he in my mask collection. Actually, it's kind of neat. The, uh, I'm looking at the two of them here in my line. Debrinkit, Wilson, Edmund, Matt Murray. Come on back. I don't know if we'll ever see him play again as a Maple Leaf. Oh, I haven't seen one of those yet, but I've only opened one box, so really I'm, as I say, I don't get out much. Piotr, Piotr Kochikov. Peter Kochikov. Very shiny card. I want to get my gum fingers all over it. Run out of the space. Let's move my base. I made a rhyme. Hey. Okay. Um, Mark Nook, Little Chagrin, and Zach Cassian. What's the big cards in these? I guess, like I say, the acetates. I don't know if there's any other Easter eggs that I, I don't know about. Kubelik. Ax Axel Johnson Shalby. I don't know how you say that. Shalby. Something like that, maybe. Strahlman. Oh, cool. Uh, Johnny Goudreau. UD Exclusives. Retro Design. That's numbered 16 of 100. Very shiny. The 0708 Tribute. UD Exclusives. Johnny Goudreau. We'll see how he likes it with the new coach. Now I'm really messed up. I'm totally running out of space. Okay, we'll put him front and center. Front and center meaning off to the left. Uh, okay. Um, Bjorkstrand, Zach Aston Reese, Troy Terry, Joe Pavelski. We got a nice little bit here, four packs to go. Count them down. Let's see. What do we got? We got a checklist. We got Jack Hughes All Star. We got Casey Sezikis, Aiden Hill. Hey, there he is from Comox. Just up the highway, although it'll take me about five hours to get there right now because of the detours. It only really normally take about an hour, but anyway, I'm going to put that aside. Even though it's just a small goalie mask, I like Aiden Hill. I like my goalies. There's Lawson Kraus, Canvas, Vitek Vanacek, Gensel, and Josh Brown. I don't know, just the goalie pictures in general. They look so much more action-packed. Like some of these guys, they're just skating. They're like the Goudreau card. You know, he's just sort of, hey, I'm just skating. McDavid, yep, I'm just skating away here. Like, how about taking a shot pictures? Goalies are always, like, in action. 
You know, he is probably just in warm-ups there doing some stretches, but it looks like he's making a save. Max Domi. Ben Sherratt. Jimmy Vesey. Not even years. Right on, I'm getting all the good ones. Draft. Looks like I'm going to get three and three as opposed to four and two like the last one. Gustafson, Manson, Cal Connor. Look, look at the flow going on. Cal Connor there. I never noticed that before. So I was wearing a helmet when I see him. Yan Rutu. Two to go. Okay, we got Frederick Chinikov. Chinikov. Tyler Mott. Ethan Bear. Bo Horvat, no longer with the Canucks. He got moved abruptly. To, and he's apparently very happy in Long Island right now. Vitrano, Dolan, and Mark Stone. Last pack in the break. Let's just move my Johnny. Thanks again for watching, everybody. Sure do appreciate all your people that are subscribed and keeping this channel going. It really does, uh, is what I do now. This is my thing. I'm a card guy. Oh, my. But, yeah, no, it really does make, make a big difference for everybody who's joining the channel. And I try to keep providing breaks of quality and not just random stuff. Paul Stasny, Ryan McDonough, Curtis Lazar. Here's the Kirill of part one of the three-part insert set from the 97-98 Collector's Choice Commemorative. CMKK1. Anyway, there's three cards. There's the picture of all three of them together. I'm sure you've seen these by now, too. Kind of a new idea. I like Marcus Johansson looking very serious. Morgan Geeky. Ilya Lubushkin. And Nazem Kadri, the All-Star. Well, I, again, I, I might have one more of these ripped just because I'm building a set now by the looks of it. Maybe I'm not. I don't know. It is kind of a fun rip, and I do have one more box, so it'll probably happen. And I can play with my goalies head-to-head. -head. All right. Thanks again, folks. Take it easy. Standing away, Chanel.